This week, Francis comes to patch our roof. We repaint the bathroom, and we get a few surprises for the chateau. Today, Francis and his crew are here to work on the chateau roofing and show Ian the rope so he can get started on cleaning our moat for this spring. <laughs> okay. Là, tu fais un nœud de bout de corde. Le bout de corde, c'est le 8. Non, tu fais juste ça. Ok. Et tu... Ah, c'est le the bottom. Okay. Et tu, tu jettes. <rire> tu jettes la corde. Au revoir. Voilà. <rire> tu remets dedans. Hop. Hop. Et voilà. Et voilà. Yes. Et voilà. Very good. <rire> Première fois. Hein. Very good. Ah, parfait. Est-ce que ton Je me suis sali là. Hein ah hein, oui, hein, oui, c'est oui, quoi oui. ça <rire> C'est Ah Oh là 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 là. C'est juste euh... Non. Non. Tu rentres là. Ah Yes. Voilà. Ouais. Voilà. OK. Et après dedans encore. Là. Et l'autre côté. OK. Oh, ouais, ouais. <rire> ouais, 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 il y a du mal à s'habiller. Hein. <rire> C'est ça qui doit l'aider parce qu'il a un peu de mal, hein, ce garçon. Oui. Je ne me sens pas comme un toddler en right <rire> Ok, oui. Voilà. Ouf. Ça. Vas-y, tire. L'autre oui. aussi. Vas-y. Même. Yes. Ça vient de là. Ça part là. la poignée et tu refermes okay. toujours fermé oui ok <rire> voilà et après vas-y et après okay. c'est toi qui joue avec ça pour descendre vas-y Dou doucement 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 oui. voilà Ok. Tu lâches, stop. Et ça pour descendre. Mais attention, hein, doucement hein, la descente. Hein, c'est. Euh, oui, bien sûr. Oui. C'est vraiment. Euh, ça descend vraiment. Oui. Ok. Ok. C'est bon comme ça ou c'est nécessaire pour le, le pied Non, 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 non. Juste comme ça, c'est bon. Après, il y, y a une sellette qu'on peut mettre qui vient se projeter là et là. Oui. Pour que tu sois mieux assis euh, quand tu travailles. Quand tu, si tu es, si es assis, pour, tu te positionnes et, et c'est plus confort. Ça okay. évite d'avoir mal, de faire oui. de la circulation oui. sans oui. te couper. Là. Ok. Voilà. Voilà. C'est ok Yes Bon, voilà. Hey, oui. il, est, il est beau, il est beau. Il Ça est marche. Beau. <rire> Ça marche. Oui, toi aussi, je viendrai aussi. Hein <rire> Look, so, car <laughs> C'est très bon C'est une bonne voiture Une belle voiture, oui yes. Une belle voiture, oui 1953 <laughs> 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 While Francis was showing Ian the ropes, his workers were able to reinforce the cracked beam in the chateau and patch some of the gutters.
In January, Francis found a water leak that caused a support beam to crack. La poutre, la poutre qui est là sur le côté. Oh. Ouais. Il y a des infiltrations là. Today, we finally had it reinforced. The cost of replacing the beam was way out of budget, so we were relieved to find a more affordable way to mend it. C'est tout. Voilà. Ouais. <laughs> ah. Ça fait déjà un, un gros, un gros renfort. Hein. Oui. So Daphne and I were going to put up the rest of the sheetrock in here, and then we realized that the sink pipes have not been adjusted by the plumber yet. So we have to wait on that. So instead, I'm going to paint the ceiling because that needs to be done. And that starts with this. Oh, no, I broke the zipper, <laughs> no. Uh. So I finished caulking the ceiling and sanded everything. It looks pretty smooth. Now we just need to put the primer on and then paint. And we got gloves on, so we're good to go. Yeah, they're really big though. Rule number one, there are no rules. Rule two, don't kick over the paint bucket. <laughs> <laughs> Arkea? <laughs> Arkea is definitely itching herself. <laughs> when Arkea itches herself, she kicks her leg like a rabbit. So she was just kicking the door. <laughs> How did you get paint behind you? There's <laughs> literally a splotch on the wall. I don't know. Look, I'm not some kind of wizard. I'm just trying to paint stuff. Oh, this is so good. I'm really excited with how this turned out. I would definitely hire us again. <laughs> yeah, this is really nice. So next thing is we need to put up the walls while we wait for the shower pan to arrive and then everything else. <laughs> So when my dad was here, we tried pouring epoxy in and it went right through. It didn't stay in any of the holes <laughs> and ended up all over the back of it. So this time we're gonna try it, but we're gonna pour sand in first and we are going to have more success today because it is warmer. <laughs> yeah, I think that was the main component. It's seeping out. This stuff is very porous. There must porous. be a hole. Okay, so. It's not working. 
It's not working. It's not working. It's keeping a gap and the resin is just running away. So it looks like the epoxy is actually staying in this little one here. So I'm thinking we're gonna try and put some epoxy in the big one and see if that if that works as well. But that means I need to... More a epoxy. fly got into my epoxy. <laughs> Well, that is essentially what I had in mind. Uh, minus the allergies. <laughs> <laughs> We've got some limestone filler and we're gonna try putting this in here and see what this looks like. So we have a few different options and we wanna know what you think. Um, our first option is to just simply fill in all the holes with the limestone filler, which is turning out to be quite nice. The second option is to fill most of it with the limestone filler, but then whenever there's crevices that aren't full on holes, to fill those with resin and do a little flower decoration in those. And the third option is to go ahead and fill it completely from the back, flip it, and turn it into more of an art project where we're really going in and carving out the spaces in the holes and then coming back and filling those with resin um, and flowers. I think we can save a lot of time and just get creative with a couple really pretty areas and then we can highlight those by putting them in really noticeable spots in the bathroom. It's the best of both worlds. Over the last month, we had a film crew here filming all over the domain, and they put in a bunch of props, and some things are more structural, and this is one of them. It's an awesome dock that's actually brand new, but they stained it and burnt it and chipped at the edges to make it look a little older. And when Benoit was here, he checked it out, and he was like, it's a great dock. I can help you work on the foundation a little bit. So basically we have a dock that's going to be good for at least a couple years, but it's so cool because we've like always imagined having a dock out here and now we have it. <laughs> so we're still debating on whether or not we want to like sand it down and restain it and make it look fresh, like clean up the edges a little bit, or if we want to keep it looking like an old dock. They did ask if they could leave the fire pit and I was, all about it at first. Now I'm thinking that we might want to actually replace it with like a barbecue so that it can be cleaner <laughs> for like wedding photos, but maybe we'll take advantage of it for like one little bonfire. <laughs> We also wanted to show you this beautiful antique door that's from Spain that our last film production left for us. Um, unfortunately, the door that we had here had been broken into and was just, we, we couldn't put it back up. And so we were super stoked when the decoration team said that they would be able to leave us this door. Unfortunately, they did have to cut out a little piece of the door for a scene that they haven't filmed yet and that they have to bring to another venue. But they did do a pretty good job of covering it up. And if we're lucky at the end of the movie, they will be sending it back to us so that we can put it in. We finally got our Meridian. I've been waiting for this thing for so long, but just got it and now we get to unwrap it and Ian you remember how I was like I don't need a knife for my birthday <laughs> yeah I need a knife <laughs> here you go thank you <laughs> <laughs> oh look at that look at that color is that not beautiful I love it it's a very crimson red. Yes, it is. I don't know why, but Arkea looks really nervous about this. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, gonna be okay, Arkea. 
It's okay. It's like when my family would do the Secret Santa game and I would wrap my brother's gifts in like 30 layers of wrapping paper just to watch him open it for 20 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and there's just this little tiny thing at the end. You can just pull it. The couch has a really cool shape to it. It's called a meridian, darling. Da, 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 da. Wow. <laughs> Look how beautiful. That is very nice. And can you believe this was used? Okay. Yes. Ready? It's not really, heavy really at light. all. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm just realizing? What? This is the first piece of furniture that I purchased for the chateau. Really? Yep. Oh yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. That's oh. not bad. Oh. oh. <laughs> I don't think you can hop on this, though. No, you stay away. Keep all of your white little furs away from you this. You and your fluff. <laughs> Thank you for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, then please consider subscribing. And if you'd like to support us and get exclusive content, join us on Patreon. Hey, tu sais que tu étais exceptionnel. En tant que caméraman, tu étais top. Je t'ai vu, tu t'es déplacé, tu as fait des, des profondeurs d'angle. C'était lui qui m'a mis en route. C'est pas de ma faute. C'est pas de ma faute. C'est pas de ma faute. Non. Now it's recording. <laughs>